welcome back to the Satanic Farm. I'm Arlen, and this is my wife Maggie. And you guys have already met Finley if you watched the other video, our short-haired border collie. Usually running around outside while I'm working. And today he's gonna be running around inside while I'm working, which will probably be a little bit of chaos, but that's okay. So today we are working on, what's it called again? A breakfast nook. Okay, is that officially what it's called? Thanks. We had our kitchen table right here, and then we had our chairs around it, and you could not get behind the thing, you could not get around the thing. It was an absolute disaster, and we want to fix that. Actually, uh, Maggie's plan from the beginning was to do a nook of some sort, a breakfast nook over here. The window was a little bit of a challenge for us because we weren't really sure if we wanted to block off some of the bottom of that. We have since decided that that's okay to do. We're gonna do that. We're gonna take and begin our breakfast nook bring it over to here and then from this side all the way to the end and we figure it only it'll only be about this high or so so it won't be blocking much of the window I think it's gonna work out good for us the seats are gonna open on them we have the possibility there of, of storage inside of it so that's gonna be nice we can never seem to get enough storage around here I have it in my mind how I'm gonna do this so I'm gonna take make sure I got my measurements right here I'm gonna go outside to the woodshed today because it's raining I have everything under cover I'm gonna make my cuts and then I'm gonna bring all my material back in start putting it together so first things first we want to make sure we get our measurements right 15 inches and then we want to do six feet right that puts us like right here that's perfect I think Yeah, I think that would be good. Finley you're so helpful can you take that end Okay, so this one's gonna be 87. Is that what you said earlier? Yep. Well then, our measurement was right on then. Now the big thing, the height. Do we wanna measure how high those chairs are? Cause I think yeah. if we go that height at least, it should be fine, right? Yeah, 18 inches. So 18 inches high. High. 87 <laughs> inches Under the window. long, six feet long, 15 feet, or er, 15 <laughs> inches. Yeah, 15 feet <laughs> wide. We're gonna need more wood, 15 feet, <laughs> 15 feet wide. Okay, so this should be all I need for my cuts, right? I think so. Okay, I'm gonna go do that. I'm gonna go get everything cut, bring it in. It should go right together, right? In theory. If my cuts are right. <laughs> All the pieces are cut, it's a matter of putting it together. Yeah, three more times. But that gives you an idea. Hmm? Finley, move. <laughs> You're a pain. You regret this? Do I? Yeah. No, I'm starting to wonder if you do. No. Two down, two to go. There's your two.
Yeah, I think the way to do this is to flip it upside down. Oh, that's a Just keep doing what we're doing. Just don't forget which one is the top and which one is the bottom. No. See if I cut it right. Oh, I did. You promise not to mess it up? I'll do my best. How's the height feel? Good. No. Well, what do you think? That's good. Hammer. Hammer. Okay, this 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 piece and this piece are done, right? You've already got those nailed on, both of those, right? Right. Okay, I'll go ahead and start working on those then. This one's almost done. I just got this last part to do, which I might need you to do. Because you're not a lefty. Okay, that one's done. <clears throat> so I'm gonna do the long one first, and then I'll see if it works to have to have that side overlapping a little bit. Yeah, that's good actually. Well, this is it for now. We're done with this phase of it, and that's all we'll include on this video. I'll post a follow-up video of the finishing touches. We're gonna take and put hinges on these seats so that they lift up for storage. And then we're gonna take and put some molding around the top of the seats and some crown molding around the bottom edges just to make it look like a piece of furniture. And then we're gonna paint it and then that'll be it. So that'll be a separate video that'll be coming soon. But for now, that's it. Hope you enjoyed the build. Uh, we're very pleased with it. Not sure what we're gonna do for cushions on the top yet. Right now we're just using the seat cushions from our, our previous dining set but that's going to work it's functional for us right now we'll get the table in here and it's ready to be used